All right, this is going to be a little bit different. Uh, based on the title, you can already see this is going to be an unboxing video of the Jordan 36 Lowe's. Uh, based on my username, right? Trust the process, 369. Like the numbers 369 are like massive to me. So 36 was already a number I was looking out for. When I got the Jordan 36 highs, the black infrareds, which I have right here. I actually keep these still in the exterior box just because I'm extra like that. Um, I'll go ahead and break these out. I fell in love with these shoes, right? I absolutely fell in love with these shoes. They are so comfortable. I guess I got used to buying retros uh, and I've kind of fallen off. Like the last pair of retros I have are actually low top Jordan 11 low snake skins. And I love those shoes. They are probably one of my favorite shoes. Definitely summertime favorite shoe. But, uh, but these right here, these are epic. So I kind of wanted to just go through some of the differences between the highs and the lows because I do see some right off the bat and I'm gonna open these with you and just kind of go over some concerns that I have with these shoes because uh, honestly, I just didn't see too many people out there unboxing these and maybe it's just, they're just not that popular. And fun fact, the more a sneaker is, I guess, not as widely spread or there's not as many people wearing them, the more likely I am to actually purchase those shoes. So let's go ahead and get into it. I'm gonna leave these off to the side here real quick. Let's go ahead and get these out. I will I will do an on feet uh, because again, I kind of get like irritated with some of the on feet out there. Like it's pretty basic. Like it's not that big of a deal. I feel like it's just it's too much like walking funny. Like they're sneakers, they're meant to be worn. So here we go, size nine and a half. Jordan 36 low infrared. They're actually listed as, uh, let's see, infrared 23, infrared 23 black, blah, blah, whatever. So I actually saw this in a video online I, I saw one person do an unboxing and he mentioned the toe box the toe box definitely just right off the bat seems a little bit flimsier and I gotta be honest with you um, for the price tag it's a little bit dejecting to me uh, to see maybe a little bit lesser quality on this sneaker um, just to be real I, I really do love the shoe my only real issue right now is like what I'm gonna rock with these like it was already difficult finding Outfits to rock with the the high top, right? So let me pull out one of these these have been worn a few times because I really just love these shoes so um, I don't need to pull both of them out but But it's already like trying to find something to wear with these like this is like I got this shirt off of, uh, I think it's the name of the website is sneakermatchtees.com. Uh, I'm not affiliated with them, but they do make pretty good t-shirts. I just got this one in the mail yesterday. I got another one that is actually like what I would consider to be more infrared than this shirt is. This is more of kind of like that, that traditional, uh, I don't know, team, gym red, whatever. Um, but these shoes right here, might be one of the most comfortable pairs of Jordans I've ever purchased. Like these, these are just epic. But when you look at, when you look at the, the toe box uh, on these and you just kind of like feel the difference. Now I still have the, uh, like this cardboard piece stuck on the inside, but you can see like that's, that's just like super flimsy there. Um, and when you're looking at the highs, like, it's just, it's like, it's tighter. You know what I mean? Like it just, I don't know how to explain it. Now we'll see how, how I feel about these once I put these on. Um, but just looking at them, like I can see where the concern comes in with, uh, the, the guy that I watched. Um, another thing I don't know about is this, like this material right in here. This is like this felt like 
that's what it feels like to me. It's like felt. I'm sure there's actual descriptions uh, for what material this is, but um, but I can see already that this is gonna pick up like lint. It's gonna pick up like anything like that and probably be a pain to clean or to keep clean. Um, nevertheless, I had to get these. I had to. Uh, there's another colorway, maybe a couple more colorways that are gonna come out in the lows, but I didn't wanna take a chance missing out on these because I am, I don't know, there's just something about having lows during the summertime. The, the on feet, I'm probably gonna be wearing my black jeans with these just to really uh, I don't know see how they look with pants but um, but I don't know I, I just there's it is interesting to see I have no idea what I'm gonna rock these with like these are obviously these are I mean these are gonna pop like you can just see like off of black like with black jeans like I mean these are gonna pop like crazy but finding a shirt that actually matches uh, would be interesting. It's a little bit, I don't know, uh, trippy to me to think that Jordan Brand doesn't really ever sell too many like t-shirts that match their shoes. I never really thought about that. I always thought they did, but when I bought these, right, when I got these, I was like, oh, let me find a shirt to go with them. I found one shirt. Uh, I actually bought, they have like, uh, I don't know, like a series of shirts. One says Chicago, one says New York one says Los Angeles and they're all like upside down and uh, hindsight now I probably would have picked up the Chicago one but uh, but at the time I picked up the Los Angeles one uh, I just like the way it looked I thought it was cool uh, it's got that kind of block lettering like this kind of reminds you of like the Supreme logo uh, but either way that was the closest that I could find to like an infrared color from Jordan Brand. Like, uh, there was a couple of Nike shirts that I found, like one on Foot Locker, but it just didn't really match. So trying to find something that's gonna match this, it's gonna be interesting. Now, the other shirt that I got from SneakerMatchTees.com or TeesMatchSneakers, whatever it is, um, I'll leave a link in the description, but. Um, the other shirt definitely is more of an infrared color than this is, but uh, but yeah, that's that's pretty much it is what it is, man. I mean, we'll see on the uh, on the on foot. We'll see how these look. I'm gonna go ahead and get into that. I mean, there's really not much more to say about these. Um, I do really love the clear sole on these, although they're already starting to get a little bit dirty. But man, I'm gonna tell you right now, man, these shoes being slept on slept on like i haven't seen one person wearing these shoes which is one of the reasons why i love this shoe so much is when i wear this out like nobody's rocking it like nobody and i love wearing shoes that nobody rocks i'm tempted to buy another pair of these just because i like them that much and i've already like worn these so many times in the last like month that it's just it's ridiculous so uh yeah so we'll get into the on foot now and uh hopefully hopefully you enjoyed this video this probably is a crappy unboxing but it'd be like that sometimes it's not really what i do on this channel i'm out well not really see you in a sec peace